to do yeah. that, yeah. Um, and just make sure they're done by three of the end of the day. Good morning, Begs the Heath Academy. It is Friday the 15th of May, and I hope I find all of you well this morning. It is the end of what has been a very busy week, and as I spoke to you about yesterday, and I know that as Mr. Mr. Sparks spoke to you about earlier in the week, we've been really impressed with how you've been getting involved with your class assessments. Today is the last day of class assessments um, and there are assessments in a number of subjects taking place today. Now, I know that Mr. Sparks mentioned to you yesterday that should you have missed any of your assessments this week, there is an opportunity to sit those today in any of your lessons where you're not due to be taking an assessment. So if you're sat at home today and you know that because of a tutoring session earlier this week, or because of um, some other reason you were unable to sit your assessment, and that is still outstanding, today is your last opportunity to make sure that that is done. If you need any support from us in order to make that happen, um, please do get in touch with us, but you will find links on the virtual learning dashboard to all of the assessments that have taken place this week. So do have a look there first. You'll also find on the virtual learning dashboard that there is a page containing frequently asked questions. So if you're having any problems, that's also a good place to check to see if there's any suggestions about how that can be resolved. But today's the last day for those class assessments. So please make sure that by three o'clock this afternoon, if any of those assessments need to be completed, that you've got those sorted out. But before we move on from our class assessments, it has to be said yet again, just how impressed I am at the level of engagement that we've seen this week and the huge amount of hard work that, that each and every one of you has put in to make sure that you've um, tried your very best with each of those assessments. Um, I know that Miss Shallow will be talking about this a little bit later in assembly, um, but a reminder from me that next Wednesday is Thank a Teacher Day. And I know that lots of you have been spending the week thinking about how you want to say thank you to that member of staff that has been supporting you here at Bexley Heath Academy. And there is lots to be proud of. Um, and there is lots of opportunity over the next few days to be able to take the time to say thank you to all of those members of staff that have been supporting you as a student. And there'll be more information from Miss Shallow a little bit later in the assembly. The last thing from me before I hand over to Miss Collier, is that please don't forget, and I know we remind you of this every day, but it's really important, please don't forget to register um, for your classes each day. And what you will find on the top of your email from Mr. Sparks each and every day is a direct link to that register. Secondly, um, you will find a link to each of those registers at the top of each of your classrooms throughout the day. So two places to check, the top of the email from Mr. Sparks or at the top of your classroom, um, you'll find a link there to the register and please make sure that you're signing in every day. Um, I'm now gonna hand over to Miss Collier. Miss Collier. Thank you, Mr. Napier. Good morning, everyone. Um, got a couple of things to talk to you about today. So one, I just wanted to update you on the, uh, the sweets. Can you guess the sweets quiz? Um, so there were two good attempts. So Charlie Amos in year eight and Tia Barnes-Wells in year 10 were close, but not quite right. There was one, only one other person who got all of the answers correct, and that was Rochelle Barnes. So congratulations. There were only three people who entered, got all of them correct. So well done to you three. I will be publishing the answers on social media a little bit later today, so you can double check your answers. Um, and now I have the pleasure of doing the birthday shout out. So today we have two six form birthdays. We have Pam in year 13 who is 19 today and Dia in year 13 who is 18 today and then tomorrow we have four birthdays so we have Haysam in year 7 who will be 12, we have Libby in year 9 who will be 14, we have Harry in year 12 who will be 17 and we have Adina in year 10 who will be 15. So uh, congratulations to those people who've got birthdays, the sun is shining for you and it will be shining tomorrow. Have lovely days, be safe and now I'm going to pass over to Miss Shallow. 
Thanks, Miss Collier. Good morning, everybody. So I'm here today just to remind you about the big day that's coming up next week, Wednesday, the 20th of May is going to be Thank a Teacher Day. So guys, I'm asking every single one of you to get out of bed if you're still in bed and make sure you go onto the school's dashboard. There's a nice big yellow banner that says Thank a Teacher Day. Click on that and it will take you into the display wall. So if I were a student, this is exactly what I will be doing today. After having designed my thank you message, I'm going to go onto that display board and literally upload my picture so that when it comes to Wednesday next week, I know for a fact my teacher will open that wall and see a thank you from me saying how much I've appreciated them this year. So this is what you need to do all. Just make sure you think about at least five different members of staff within the academy. So this could be a teacher, um, your, one of your TAs, it could be the pastoral team, it could be um, the attendance officer, any five uh, members of staff that you feel have actually made a difference to you this year. And just leave a message, put it on that wall. Today is the deadline, guys. By 5 p.m. today, we'll be collecting all your information and getting it ready for next week, Wednesday. Have a fantastic day. I'll now pass you over to Miss Mush. Good morning, Bexley Heath Academy. And today I have the pleasure of doing the teacher shout out. Shout out. The other day I say to you all, why do teachers do what they do? And today, this is one of the reasons why teachers do what they do. When you get great students who try their best all of the time it's not just about a stars it's not just about grade nights it's about effort it's about enjoyment it's about engagement year 12 harley francis simona saba and amy orin your teacher mr tager says in finance you have shown excellent effort on work set and consistently improving your work by making sure you read that feedback that your teachers give you and do you know what harley francis simona saba and amy orin I might come to you from some financial advice because you are our leaders of finance tomorrow. Finn Pierce, year 12, health and social care team says you are always engaging in a positive manner in the online lessons. And I know how hard that is when you're used to being in a classroom and you are engaging with your teachers just face to face, but with a screen between you. Well done, Finn. Keep it going. And then I have, last but not least here, from Mrs. Blazveska, Mohamed Wasini, Miglena Kudikova, Clara Rubeki, Bianca Bobok, Gobi Parathis, Thomas Holmes. Excellent attendance, Miss Blazveska says. Excellent progress in your touch typing club. And then one special mention, you're all special, but Harry Carr today, you get a special mention. Why? Because from Miss Blasveska, you've been unusual, unusually brave. You have pushed your limits throughout this term and you've been so big hearted, even when things were so tough, you've kept going. Well done to all of you and have a fantastic weekend. I hand you over to Miss Luthba. So I wasn't actually meant to be part of the assembly. Um, I was just picking up my box. But seeing as though I'm here, uh, guys, I've missed you. I haven't seen you for ages. Uh, I would like to get into a conversation and ask you how you're doing. But I know, you know that you're sat there telling me how you're doing through the screen. So thank you so much for that. I look forward to listening to it through emails. Now, guys, our BA family, as I've said, is growing day by day. And actually, our family members are what keeps the school going. Our family members and the great things that you say motivate us to run the lessons, do the live assemblies, and actually make those phone calls to check in on how you're doing. So thank you for that. Now, parents, if you're watching, listen up very carefully. There is a survey that's been sent out by a company called Aduro. Now, if it is that you want us to keep developing and getting better, please give us some feedback. So Aduro is a company that would have sent out that link to, uh, directly to your email. Please open up that email, answer a few questions, and we can use that feedback to make this school the best school, My, I'm, dare I say it, in the world, okay? in the world that's what we want world-class status so your feedback any positive comments any areas of development we want to listen to it and we want to act upon it um guys all i can say is 
I know that you've missed me. Next week, don't worry, every single day I will be here for you. So don't you worry about that. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to collect my box because that's what I came to get in this morning. I'm going to hand it over to Miss Delva. Uh, see you guys next week. Bye. <laughs> Thank you very much, Miss Lucifer. Okay, so the last words for me are stay stay safe while you are in self-isolation or while you're at home. Make sure that you stay at home. Do not go out unless it's really, really important and vital. If you have to go outside, make sure that you remember to follow the two-meter rule. Wash your hands um, uh, regularly and make sure that you keep healthy and fit by doing a bit of exercise. And also, please remember, thank a teacher. Please go on the website, click on the banner, make sure that you write a little note for a teacher that you want to thank. You can do a piece of art. You can write a little message. You can do it in... Um, in a different language. I'm a linguist, sorry about that. You can do it in a different language if you want to be a bit different, okay? So um, make sure you thank a teacher and have a great day, everybody. Bye.